two London clubs who've had plenty to say for themselves over the years and when they face each other it's difficult to take your eyes off the spectacle stay with us it's Chelsea against Arsenal live from Stamford Bridge Hello everyone, great to be with you from Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray, joined here in the commentary position as always by Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Chelsea up against Arsenal. I'm excited Derek, really looking forward to this game. Come on, bring it on. Well, Chelsea have scored more goals than any side in the league. It's a wonderful record they put together, Lee. Yeah, well, their forwards should be full of confidence. They've been in fantastic form of late. Bodes well for the neutrals today. Should be an entertaining match, Derek. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Kurt Zuma plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Mateo Kovacic starts with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Now, there has been some discussion about their style of play. Some would argue it's on the negative side. What realistically should we expect, Lee? Yeah, they do tend to collapse when they don't have the ball. They sit off the opposition, almost inviting pressure onto them before trying to open up when they do have the ball. I don't think we'll see any changes today in that approach. And now they get the ball rolling. Mount. Werner. Here's Mount. Here's Kovacic. Rhys James. Mount. Here's Chilwell. Abraham. Really good challenge. Not a great pass. Going forward well, Obama Yang. Could cross it in here. A deep delivery. Now the keeper dealt with the danger. Bamiyang. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Conte. Here's Mount. Mateo Kovacic. James. Here's Kovacic. Mount. Moving the ball effectively. Really good block. And now the delivery. Well, that is a moment I'm sure he wishes he could have back. Well, he did everything right, the movement and everything. He got his head on it, but it's way, way off target. El Nenny. Now Lacazette. In position here to protect the ball. Partey. And now William coming into it. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Mount. Here's Kovacic. 
Rhys James. Conte. Mateo Kovacic. And take it away. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Ziyech. Werner. An attack full of promise. Not a good pass. Mateo Kovacic. Credit to them for winning back possession. Saka. Options in the middle. Plattered away. Werner. Mount Mateo Kovacic and played the pass well Ziyech played towards the back post not a smart enough cross there but no attacker able to touch it Conte here's Kovacic tremendous block Conte. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. And he takes it away. Kovacic. And Golo Conte. Real danger. And here's Ziyech. Saka. Not the pass he had in mind. Possession stats for Chelsea, pretty good. But that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Ziyech. It's there for him. A oh, tremendous block. Pulls it back. So a throw in here. It needs an accurate cross. And the cross comes to nothing in the end. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Rhys James. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick. The crowd haven't had too much to cheer about for a while, have they, Derek? They need a goal here. And he's fired over the corner. Chilwell. He cuts it back. Mount. Given away by Chelsea. And on the electronic board showing one additional minute. Lacazette. Hector Bellerin. It's with William. And there goes the half-time whistle. It's an even picture here. Well, Lee, focusing on Chelsea, your thoughts? The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half.
El Nenny. Obama Yang. Bukayo Saka. Now he must favour the cross. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Abraham. Werner with it now. Mateo Kovacic. Well, they've lost the ball. And space here on the flank. And a timely intervention. Mateo Kovacic. Thomas. So a throw in to Chelsea. Mount. Mateo Kovacic. Here's Mount. Conte. Here's Kovacic. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. N'Golo Conte. Werner. Chilwell. Delivering it into the box. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Well, as he hit that one, it looked as though it had a chance. Well, that was the chance to take the lead, and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Holding. Thomas now. It's a weighted pass. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. He's given it away. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. And Golo Conte. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Teammates in the middle. Conte. Mount. Here's Chilwell. And Mount. Conte, but it can't get all the way through. So, 20 minutes to go. Well, borderline offside, but correct. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Coming onto the pitch, number five, Jorginho. N'Golo Conte and winning it back Tammy Abraham Conte excellent assessment of the situation at the back Bodies forward, and the break looks on. End product or not. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Given away by Chelsea. Chelsea regaining possession. Oh, in with a chance! Jorginho 
It's still alive. Crossing possibilities. Crossed accurately towards the far post. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Werner. Jorginho. Only five minutes left for play and tension galore with the teams locked together. Chance to play it in. Abraham! Insufficient accuracy with the head early. Yeah, he got there as well. It was all about could he get it on target, but when you see how far he missed, wow. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Saka and a goal at this stage might well turn out to be decisive teammates in the middle and far from the ideal cross keeper's ball all the way Werner on to Abraham well, that's a well-timed pass. He just needs to stay level-headed now. This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no. There's another chance, and there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. So the game has restarted and Chelsea are the team with the lead. Number five, Jorginho. So the final whistle, and what we can say officially now is that Chelsea have picked up maximum points from this fixture. Lee, your thoughts? Well, it just shows you, Derek, my dad was right all those years ago. He said, Lee, play to the very end of every game. You never know. And there it is, the late winner to grab all three points. And now they get the ball rolling. And now the delivery. Well, that is a moment I'm sure he wishes he could have back. Well, he did everything right, the movement and everything. He got his head on it, but it's way... It looked as though it had a chance. Well, that was the chance to take the lead, and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. Abraham! Insufficient accuracy with the head early. Yeah, he got there as well. It was all about could he get it on target, but when you see how... On to Abraham. Now oh, that's a well-timed pass. He just needs to stay level-headed now. This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. 